Now, welcome back to Manderbilly.com. This is part three of a three-part lesson on Rock and Roll Star by Oasis, and in this part I'm going to cover the outro to finish off the song, so let's get started. Okay, the outro, um, you've just come out of the chorus, uh, which you played three times, um, and, you know, this time while they're playing... <laughs> Um, Noel, I guess, is doing some... He's taking that double stop that you play in the initial... And he's just kind of... Um, so it, it sounds more like... And then they go into the, the outro proper. And um, I think that uh, Noel probably plays this with a slide, but you can get the same or a similar effect. Um, you're starting off on the... Um, you're starting off on the A string, and you're, you're sliding up uh, from the 10th fret to the 12th. Uh, and then you're taking... So that's your, your middle finger. You're taking your uh, first finger and you're putting it on the D string. Um, and you're starting here on the ninth. You're going to slide the whole thing up like this. So you end up on, on the uh, 11th. So 10, 9, 12, 11. And it's just... Uh, and then back down. four times and then he moves into the true slide part and if you have a slide you can play it if uh, if you're not using a slide for the rest of the song uh, basically what you're doing is um, you're, you're going between um, an F sharp chord uh, that's up here at the uh, at the ninth fret and an E chord to seven you're really emphasizing the D, the G, and the B string, so it's kind of like uh, the slide into it. It's like and then it gets sort of choppier as he goes along, and it's sort of like you know. As the uh, vocalist singing, you know, it's just rock and roll, and you just kind of continue with that until you, you know, fool around with that until you fade. That's so. That's pretty much the uh, the whole song, and um, have fun with it. It's uh, one of the best rock and roll songs out there. Take care.